Okay, guys, so this company is called Bia Hairs. So this is, they sent me this wig. It's a um, Beyonce Way 22 Natural Medium Cap 360 front, I mean, it's 360 wig. They gave me some bomb 25 meter. These is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. They gave me some bomb lashes, not the little baby lashes. So, they gave me a cap. It's a little dark. Um, they also gave me a skin coat. So, you can, like, scan them. So, make sure you scan this to follow their pages. They gave me instructions. I love the packaging, which also has a barcode on there. Let's get into it. So, this wig was already plucked. Super Plus. This wig was already bleached. Super Plus. All I did was bleach over it and use my shimmer all i did was bleach over use my shimmer and lights to get the raspiness out that's all i did and this hair looks like it's coming out the scalp honey like like look at this hairline like they did such a good job at customizing it i don't have to do anything but put it on so i'm going to apply this wig and show you guys how i maintain my curls and basically just prep it to wash and go I absolutely love this and the curls still stayed in it's like a water wave type of look 22 inches is full density so if you a thick hair person this wig is perfect for you it's thick to the ends it's a 360 so I'm gonna show you guys the inside of the cap and then we're gonna get started so after you bleach your hair you want to make sure that your knots look like this so this is more of a, you could tell based off, you could tell how light your knots is going to be based off the color of this. So if it's this color, which now by doing this wig, I have learned that if it's this color, that means your knots is going to be like slick dark, darker. Your is going to be like brassy. If it's this lighter color, as you can see the transition, is going to be scap like. So, from now on, I will be trying to aim for this color. Um, it comes with two combs. I mean, two combs on the side, one in the middle. It also comes with an adjustable band in the back, a comb in the back, so you can have extra security. Um, it has a lace where you can bleach the back of the lace, you know, and have a full ponytail if you want to. Um, this is how the back looks. Um, it's lace in the back and then when you go up you can see the tracks like sorry about my cat you can see the tracks like right there so I'm going to just trim all this off install it and show you guys how I maintain this curly wig okay guys so the wig has been applied on my head good it looks really good you can't really tell right now because I look crazy um you know you oof, look a little crazy Looking a little crazy right now, but I'm gonna just pop the camera up and show you guys how I base. Okay, so I look a little crazy right now, but as you can see, this is giving you scalp realness. Look at that scalp, period. So I look kind of bald headed right now, but um, as you can see, I'm parting the section off for my baby hairs. Um, arrogance, I always said your baby hair should be very small. That's my problem. Um, my baby hairs be like super long. So I'm gonna try to do like an inch of baby hairs. And then just play around with it to try to get it to look how theirs be looking. Cause my baby hairs don't never turn out how theirs turn out. So I'm just cutting it off like that. So I'm gonna do my baby hairs and I'm gonna show you guys how I like uh, style the hair, well really wet it, puts in what I put in my curly hair to like get it popping. Look at that scalp. So I'm just cutting baby hairs. Try to style this before my camera cut off. So I go, I use this to style my hair, my baby hair. It's the Lotto Body with Coconut Shea Oils. You get it at your local beauty supply store. This is just lays your hair down. And then you just begin like playing with your edges like that, you know, like that, you know, 
begin playing with it. Mm -hmm. Straight like that. And this is how you do it. Yeah, see how this turns out? Like, scat. Looking like some. And then I'm going to tie it down. And yeah. I'm going to play with my edges, though. Really, I'm just showing you guys before the camera cut out. Because really, I'm going to play with these some more. Because my edges never turn out how I want them to turn out. This look pretty good though. Like I'm not even complaining. It looks really good. Like I went to a fucking hair salon. I like when the edges be looking like that for you. You see what I'm saying? These too long, see? They too long. I'm gonna cut it. This my probably be having them long ass baby hairs. That's why I never turn it right. So I'm about to keep doing this and playing with it. So as you can see, this is pretty much self-explanatory. And then I'm going to tie it down. Show you guys the finished results. And I just used this to tie it down. I got this from a different hair company. It goes like this. And you let that sit for a good 5-10 minutes. And yeah, I'll show you the finished results. <laughs> okay guys so if you enjoyed this bomb look well this is how i did my well i didn't show you guys how i did my baby hairs all the way but i showed you a little bit and in the morning when i wake up i'm going to show you guys how i get this look right here not this look but this look so make sure you just Give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you check out this hair company because they really outdid themselves with this hair now. The name of this wig is Beyonce and I swear I feel like Beyonce and it's purry. So make sure you go check the description box below and yeah, love ya. Okay guys, so I just woke up and this is how the hair looks. I didn't tie it down. Um, I'm about to show you guys how I just wet it at its natural state and let it dry on its own. So yeah. guys so this is the finished look hopefully you enjoyed this like mini tutorial on how i style my hair this hair is super soft super like flowy thick and i love it so much um make sure you go check out this hair company below yeah